to change. As our entertainment correspondent Lizo Mazimba reports now from Los Angeles, and his report does contain some flashing images. I decided to wake up. <laughs> the new and the old. John Boyega, one of the film's young British leads, reunited with Mark Hamill, who reprises his role as Luke Skywalker. The film's other new lead, Londoner Daisy Ridley, chats with George Lucas, the writer-director who created it all back in 1977. The meeting of the generations, a key selling point for this film, the first in more than 30 years to feature the main actors from the original trilogy. I've always been grateful for, uh, for the success these films have had. Uh, I don't think I can explain why, you know, uh, I'm not going to take on the task for explaining why they why they are, but this is a good movie and, and I'm sure people will enjoy it. Is this the day you've been waiting for when it finally goes out there and people see what you can do? Um, uh, no, because then I think I would have wished away the time before. It's very exciting for it to be here now, but um, you know, life is cool and the in-betweeny bits are cool too, so it's nice to enjoy things in waves and this is a cool wave to ride. Are you sure you're up for this? <laughs> Disney paid George Lucas more than $4 billion for the rights to the series and other Lucasfilm properties. Thanks to one of the biggest deals in Hollywood history, they plan to release a movie a year. This movie is the first stage of them trying to recoup that investment by convincing millions of fans to see the film, buy the merchandise, and then crucially to keep repeating that process as each new Star Wars film is released annually until 2019 probably beyond the reaction from members of the audience it was amazing it was honestly amazing it's like one of my favorite movies I, thought, I mean, honestly it was awesome um, i thought it was great i had really high expectations coming in it did even better than i thought anything that disappointed you or expectation nope. was too high for? Uh, there's there's uh yeah good things and bad things but uh nothing bad about the writing it was all perfect you will not be disappointed it's amazing it was amazing just it was a religious experience it was just amazing <laughs> a reaction disney would no doubt like to see repeated everywhere lisa mazimba bbc news los angeles